Good morning, Diamond Mind. This is Deborah, and I wanted to talk real quick today about how to build your diamond dream team. And I'm going to use the example of my husband because I am working with my husband to get him to diamond. And so I'm going to show you the process that we are going through to plan this out. So, right now, we start with John. He's the top of his organization. He currently has coaches on either side already, so I'm going to mark in who we already know. So, for instance, he's got a right leg and a left leg. That's what made him an emerald. He's got an emerald over here. David is an emerald. Sorry, my messages keep popping up. And then Austin over here is a coach, an active coach. So there's two. We know that to be diamond, he needs to have eight personally sponsored coaches. So he also has another brand new emerald. And then he has another new coach and another new coach. So basically what I'm doing is I'm plugging in who do we already know. So if I would have had a crystal ball, I would have put my other emerald on the other side. But I didn't have a crystal ball, so he's got two emeralds on one leg for a total of three active coaches and then two active coaches on the other leg. So at this point, we know that he has two blank spots, two blank spots on one side and three and one blank spot on the other. So in essence, he needs three more personally sponsored coaches. Now, he also needs another emerald right here on this side. So to get to diamond right now, John needs five coaches. He needs five coaches. Now, please keep in mind, I didn't say five personally sponsored coaches. He needs five coaches. So when I go about planning my rank advancements with myself or my team, I ask them, I ask myself, to think about What's the total number of members, of coaches, you have to add to your team to get where you need to be, okay? Because a lot of times, we just really focus on our personally sponsored. And then we get to that point, and we've got our numbers for to meet our goals, so John has his eight coaches, but he's still missing two, this guy, this emerald right here, to get where he wants to be. And you might think to yourself, well, what do I have to do with what that person does to get to Emerald? You have a lot to do with that. And we're going to talk about that in the Diamond Mind as we go forward. But this is how I build um, my planning for my organization. So right now, I'm very actively looking for people to fill in these blanks. And let me just tell you this. Since this guy right here, Austin, happens to be my son, I'm also looking for two more. So I am truly looking for five new coaches. And uh, again, that's the nice thing about having your family in your organization because basically you have already, you have more than one business center that you can work. I mean, you can't officially open your second business center until you are a two-star diamond, but by having your spouse, by having John in my business, he's basically a second business center that I have control over. By having my son it's basically a third business center I have control over. So I have complete control over getting this whole business center to Diamond. So that's how I want you to think about things. Um, I want you to right now, you are striving to get to Diamond. I would like for each of you to build your dream team organization. Show us who you've got on each side, what their rank is, who, what are your empty blanks, how many total coaches do you need to get to Diamond? And then, do you have names? Do you have a pipeline over here of names? I've got a pipeline of 
at least 20 coaches um, that I keep on my board that I showed you the other day to help me remind me of who to follow up with. So those are your things I want you to do. Put it in a video, use a little whiteboard, use a piece of paper, whatever you want to do, but you need to get used to making videos. So we're going to help you do that too. Talk to you later.